Um, um, this is just gonna be a really super short one. It's gonna be one of those painting my nails ones. I just wanted to tell a story about a dog I met this weekend. He stayed at my house. His name was Leo. He was so sweet. He was just the best little potato man. I'm not a dog person. I didn't grow up with dogs. I have never lived with a dog in my home and I don't like the way they smell. That's a big part of it. I don't want dogs to lick me. I don't like dogs that want to like jump on me. I can appreciate dogs that are very cute and I, I obviously want to like pet them and stuff. I just think I would have a very hard time living with like a big dog in my home. It's just kind of like a force of nature that I don't want. But yeah, I met this dog this weekend. He stayed at my house and his name was Leo and he was just a really good little potato man. He was only six months old but he was so nice and like he wasn't like a puppy at all. He didn't bark. He didn't run around. He just like walked around on his little potato man legs and like snorted a lot because he doesn't really like he doesn't bark at all. He just snorts and and breathes really heavy. He would walk around on the ground and like he would just look like a little truffle seeking pig because that's just what he sounded like. He was just so nice and polite and that's my favorite quality in a dog. Just like no crazy behavior and like is just wants to like sit on people's lap and just like be around and fall asleep on the floor. My friend Colin took a video of us singing to him because we were playing a uh, musical theater karaoke on the TV. It started when I was singing next to normal at him. Like I was, uh, is his name Dan? Is the dad's name Dan? Daniel? Dave? Dan? Dan. His name is Dan. I was singing as if I was Dan. I am the one to him as if he was Diana and he was very good to play across. So then we started singing If I Didn't Believe in You for the next five years at him. I think he got a little scared by that one. It was pretty confrontational, I gotta say, but I just wanted to share this video because it really makes me laugh. If I didn't believe in you, we wouldn't be having this fight. If I didn't believe in you, I'd walk out the door and say, Leo, you're right. I never could let that go. No, no. Things when I met you four hours ago. I knew you. Never, Never took, took much convincing to make me believe. <laughs> He's got another bite. <laughs> Don't be dead to be happy, Leo. At some point down the line, don't we get to relax without some new service to keep me out further from you? Fine cheering on your side, Leo. Why can't you support my? Why do I have to feel I've committed some felony? Doing what I always swore I would do. I don't want you to hurt. Hey, wait, 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 wait. I don't want you to sink. Just listen up, man. It's just that. Don't you know when I sink? I think you know me. Don't make me wait till you poo. <laughs> Your fur. <laughs> I will not fail so you can be comfortable, Leo. <laughs> because you can't win. It's like, I'm so sorry. I'm just trying my best. I didn't know I made you feel that way. I'm just trying my best, guys. He's like, you know what makes me crazy? I'm sorry if I say this. That we can be here together at your house together. <laughs> How you doing, pal? I don't know where we are. How you doing, little? Deep down, he like just really wants to make sure you're okay. Leo, it's gonna be all right, man. I wouldn't have loved Leo at all. Hey, Leo, why don't you just go put your dress on and we'll go. We'll go. Leo.